like I do have a little bit of everything in this forecast. So let's dive in. We'll start with current temperatures outside in the 70s, low 70s, Bogalusa, Slidell, Hammond, and then in the middle 70s for the South Shore. It's a little bit breezy out there for some of you at the lakefront coming in at 10 miles per hour. Bell Chase 12 miles an hour, 9 miles an hour at the airport there. Calm for a lot of you though, north of the lake. It's dry right now on radar. We're not seeing any rain in our area, but if we move this way, look at this little piece of energy here. We're going to watch this drift towards us and it will bring a chance for rain tomorrow, but it's not going to be a widespread chance for rain. Just a few isolated showers. So tonight, partly to mostly cloudy, Overall mild with that slight breeze out there. I think a lot of you north of the lake will fall into the 60s. Pretty much everyone for the North Shore. Some of you south of the lake in the upper 60s, others in the low 70s overnight tonight. Then tomorrow the breeze sticks around. Notice will be coming out of the east 10 to 15 miles an hour. Temperatures are going to warm right back up into the middle 80s, but there's a chance for rain. It's low. It's not going to be an all day rain or a washout. In fact, I think a lot of you will stay dry. But do be aware that we'll see some pop up showers out there throughout the day tomorrow. Notice that it was warm. Yes, the warm air sticking around for a few more days. Our average high temperature 78 degrees for this time of year, and we're going to be well above that well in the 80s through Tuesday, even into Wednesday, still in the 80s. But what cools us down Wednesday? the rain and the thunderstorms. So there's only a 20% chance for rain tomorrow, Monday and Tuesday, but then notice that it bumps up to 70% on Wednesday. Expect showers, expect thunderstorms. And with this system that's moving on through, I'm keeping my eye on it and I want you to as well because I can't rule out some strong storms on Wednesday or some flooding rain either. So make sure to check back in with us for updates on Wednesday's forecast. We'll know more as the system continues to get closer to us. But right now it's something I'm definitely keeping my eye on behind that though. That's when the cooler air arrives and the fall like weather arrives. Meanwhile, in the tropics, still nothing at this time. Nothing to worry about over the next five days. It is nice and quiet, but hurricane season goes until the end of November. So something that we're still watching just in case. All right, here it all is again, a little bit of something for everyone. Sunny, rainy, warm, and then much cooler. In fact, if you are looking for the cool fall like weather, on Friday, I think a lot of us might stay in the 60s all day. And by the way, Halloween is on Sunday, so it'll be right in time for Halloween.